What's up y'all? I'm back with another slaying. Today we're going to be doing the frontal sewing. As you can see, I already did the ball cap. I have plenty of videos showing that. So yeah, right now I'm just cutting the ear tabs. You want to cut a space um, for the ear area. So that's what I'm doing right now. This lace already melted and I haven't even laid it in glue yet. Y'all already know I use Erica J Hold Me Down Adhesive. This is the only glue I will use and the only glue I've ever used since I've started doing installs. This is the only glue that I use. 10 out of 10, 10, 10. For my dark skin clients, I use Noor Lace Tint. I'll leave her link down below. Um, this lace tint doesn't leave any ashiness, it doesn't leave any residue, and it blends in with the skin perfectly on HD lace and transparent lace. Y'all gotta get y'all some of this lace tint, period. So as you guys can see, I accidentally overbleached the knots. Ladies, if you ever overbleach your client's knots, don't leave them like this. Get some mascara. Um, you can use the black hairspray. Get something to get that part right. Do not leave them like this. Um, I use black hairspray. I really don't know the name of it, but yeah i use the black hairspray to just get the part straight and you guys are going to see what i'm talking about in a minute make sure y'all are going in with y'all edge wax to make sure that that lace is laid extra flat you do not want no humpy lumpy install you want your install to be as flat as possible
Yeah, this is lay already. Like, already. This is literally my favorite hairstyle. When she told me she wanted pink skunk stripes, I instantly knew that this was going to be a banger. Like, look at this. Before the lace is even cut off, look at this. Okay, so after you section out where you want your baby hairs to be, you're just going to get some whole, um, not some whole, let me spray. You're going to get some adhesive spray and spread the legs down. I'm going in with the tweezers just to tweeze a couple more strands of hair out. You want your install to look as natural as possible, so pluck as much as you need to, even if you have to wait till you get the frontal on your client's head. Pluck 
as much as you need to. You do not want no dense hairline. So now I'm about to go in with a little more tint spray. Like I said, I love this tint spray. Y'all are gonna, y'all about to see why I love this tint spray so much. Y'all about to see. Y'all are already starting to see right now. You see when I spray the tint spray and spray the adhesive spray on top, the lace instantly melted in, instantly melted in. It's like the lace dissolved in the skin. Please don't play with me, y'all. Get into it, period. Wet lace, wet lace. Like I said, that lace tint and the adhesive spray combo, go have that lace dissolved into your skin, period. So now we're about to comb the hair out for the baby hairs and then we're going to cut the baby hairs one inch long. Some, you can cut your baby hairs long or short, it really depends on the size of your client's forehead. So yeah. I use Gorilla Snot for the baby hair. Sometimes I mix it with mousse, and sometimes I don't. It really just depends on what works best for you.
Okay, so after I'm done with those baby hairs, I'm just gonna go back in with that adhesive spray to lock everything in. And then I'm gonna tie the elastic band on for 10 minutes. Okay, so now it's time to take that wrap off those baby hairs. And y'all, y'all can't tell me I did not do, I did not pop my shit on this install. Sorry, but I just had to say, um, we're not done yet. We still have to get that part together. Do not forget, we have to get that part together. I'm just going to fluff those curls out. Um, yes, y'all, we got to get that part together right now. Please don't play with me, y'all. I promise. I know y'all can see why this style is my favorite style. It was definitely giving dark skin Barbie. I love this. I really did love this. It was so sleek, so neat, so melted. It was everything. Now I'm, I'm about to go in with that black hairspray to fix up that part. I put makeup on the part and then I spray the, spray the black hairspray. And voila, we're done. She's ready to go, y'all. She ended up going to a ball. Y'all know I had to get her right. Period. Y'all, I love it. She loved it. It was everything. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And comment down below on how y'all think I did on this. Comment down below if y'all want to see anything else. Thank you.